Hey, so I haven't done a video in quite a long time. Uh, I think two weeks to be exact. Um, so I'm actually doing one today and I am going to do a haul video. And it's about three things that I'm loving right now with the weather changes and, um, you know, once again, stuff that I love and I want to share with you guys. Okay, so the first thing on my haul list is the Burt's Bees Beeswax Lip Balm. Um, I was introduced to this. It has like a little cute bee on the top. You guys know me. I'm always going to show you guys what the product looks like. So you guys know um, when you guys go to the store to find it. It's really, really cheap. I think I bought this for like two something. Um, now they're introducing it. These, um, initially I saw at like the natural food stores. But now I see them popping up in um, your regular drug stores like Rite Aid, Walgreens. Um, I, I don't know what other drug stores there are out there. It's just I'm naming the ones that I'm familiar with. Um, it's really, really good. Uh, let me open it. I don't know if you guys out there have tried Blistex. Um, I love Blistex. There's nothing I have nothing against Blistex. It's just the consistency. It looks like this. It's just beeswax. Um, but it's like super, super soothing. Um, I love it. It's soothing. It's cooling. It's refreshing. Um, I love the consistency. I actually just use it just like this and <clears throat> go to the lip like that and just apply. I really, really like it. Blistex, you know, is sticking your fingernails. Um, it's soothing also, but it's just gooey, I think. It's like sticky on your lip. But this just goes right on. You can't see anything. Um, it soothes it right away. I use it at night especially. Um, it actually calms me down and puts me to sleep. Uh, I re really, really, really and highly, highly, highly recommend this. Um, you guys should go out there and get this. Um, my second product, I've known about this now for quite some time. And I know people are asking me. Um, I had really, really bad sinus headaches. And... My relief, I know there are some people that do have the same issue as me, especially when the weather changes. And my um, remedy to that is one day I was watching Oprah, of course. Um, if any of you guys know me, I'm an Oprah fan. Um, it's sad uh, that it's her last season, but anyway, moving on. Um, it's called a neti pot. I saw it on Oprah. It looks like this. You put the water in here and you put this portion in your nose like that you tilt your head and you let the water come out let me come this way like that and you let the water come out now the thing is you can actually feel the water going up and draining your sinuses and coming out and just be warned when the water is coming out uh, there is gunk coming out which is mucus let me just be specific um, and what a relief wow if you have sinus problems and you have like the sinus pressure sinus pressure right here like the pain from that um i definitely recommend this this is a good product um it's this one is actually called sinu cleanse i got it on my local drugstore it looks like that the box let me show it to you guys because it's reflecting um the back this is how you know <laughs> i think that was me I don't know if you guys can see it. It's a person with a huge nose. That was definitely me before I found this product. Um, I highly recommend this. It comes with um, the salt packages. Like you have to mix, you have to mix the salt in the water, and you use lukewarm water. Um, I don't actually. I don't use the whole package. I use half of it, um, and it still works. Uh, and you flush both nostrils. Uh, one at a time, of course, and um, it really, 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 really works. And I wanted to show it, um, show it to you guys, and share with you guys what I actually use for my sinus problems. Um, and last but not least, I found I'm actually loving this new drink. It's I don't know if you guys have heard of it or have had the opportunity of um, finding it or seeing it in your local stores. Um, it's called Izzy. And it looks like this. This is actually the can version that I found. Let me show it to you guys. And this is actually the sparkling pomegranate. 
love, love, love this drink. I know you can actually go out there, like if you don't want to, you know, uh, spend your money, you can go out there, buy sparkling water, and mix it with your favorite fruit juice. But I really, really love this. You guys know I oppose to high fructose corn syrup. It's only now and then that I make exceptions. I'm really trying to um, actually uh, transform or get away from um, high fructose corn syrup and definitely stay on the good stuff. But I love this. This everything, everything is in here. Um, it's all natural fruit juices that they use with sparkling water. And this one can alone has 90 um, calories in it. And it's 18 grams of sugar. I know that's probably eh, quite a bit for like a little can. But um, when you do get that kick or that urge to purchase something, um, I guess, soda-like, I will definitely recommend this. I would recommend 90 calories instead of like 150 in a regular Pepsi bottle or Coke bottle or whatever it is um, that you prefer drinking. Um, so yeah, so there are other um, flavors of course, uh, pomegranate being my number one and Clementine's actually my number two and I think they have something called lemonade, I'm not sure, don't quote me. But uh, you guys need to look out for this. I really, really, really highly recommend this. And, of course, the rest of my product that I just did the haul on. Um, go out there. You guys know I will mislead you. Um, that It's my opinion, but I want you guys to go out there and actually find these products. Test them out if you want. Email me what you think um, about these products. And uh, I will gladly <laughs> and happily read those comments. Um, I guess till next time, uh, enjoy.